I do think it's rather juicy watching some of the gaming journalists freak out over Valve or Steam deciding not to censor the Steam platform except for things that are illegal and things that are flat out trolling. That's pretty cool what they've done. And but but it is juicy watching people freak out over it. They're saying that 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 uh, Valve is is not uh, they're refusing to take responsibility for their platform and they're just being lazy and it's just like no uh, they're they're you know, th that very the very same thing that allows people to make misogynistic games also allow people to make games of any type uh, from any other viewpoint so you can have there could be a man-hating game if you wanted and it's not going to be censored so you know um, if you don't like a certain kind of game don't buy it that's my take on it now I mean you can you can call for boycotts of this game or that game you know fine but um, it's not going to do much good and I think that's what's pissing people off you were hoping that the uh, the gaming industry could be a place for for social change and yes it can be but not by force and uh, this was a type of force you know if they would have chosen to censor their platform this was a type of force they could have uh, could have used so uh, yeah uh, good on on Steam good on Valve good job Valve this, this was a good choice <laughs>